we built society on this assumption of climate stability, and that stability is changing, all these things we take for granted, they're not just givens anymore. It just released report from the Pentagon climate change and the challenges it's creating for the military. The latest report says global warming is driving weather to new levels of extremes. 99% of my intelligence told me there's an ambush waiting for me. I don't get to say, yeah, but there's that 1% that says there's no ambush. So the hell with the other 99%. As a member of the United States military in 30 plus years of service in uniform, climate change is what we call an accelerant to instability. If you have an area that is already unstable and then has the additional challenge of water shortages or food shortages or a disaster that makes people move, then you can start seeing conflict situations. Serious, deadly conflict, a full-blown civil war. If we look around the world today, we can already see conflict and climate in play right under the headlines that we're reading. A new study finds climate change exacerbated the worst drought ever in modern Syria as a consequence of human interference. Fragile social systems just need one more shock to tip them over the edge into social breakdown, into war. Failure to think about how climate change might impact our globally interconnected system is a failure of imagination. The flip side of the climate threat is the energy and resilience opportunity. As a soldier, we're always looking to have an edge on the future. We can pay now, pay later. <laughs>